the updated Audi A3 TFSI E has a new 1.5-litre engine and a 25.7kWh battery pack. The most potent of the two models can hit 100 km per hour in a respectable 6.3 seconds. Like the rest of the 2025 A3 range, the exterior and interior of the TFSI E models have been refreshed. The 2025 Audi A3 family has grown with the launch of the new A3 Sportback TFSI E in Europe, a plug-in hybrid that has more power and performance than its predecessor while also offering more all-electric range. Available in 40 TFSI E and 45 TFSI E guises, European prices start at €44,200, €48,247,700, €52,000, respectively. Both variants are powered by a new 1.5-litre TFSI Evo 2 engine with a higher compression ratio than the old 1.4-litre TFSI. This engine is good for 148 horsepower, 110 kilowatts, and 184 lbfd 250 newton meters of torque in the 40 TFSI E, and those figures grow to 174 horsepower, 130 kilowatts, and 184 lbfd 250 newton meters. In the 45 TFSI E, working alongside the engine is an electric motor integrated into the housing of the six-speed S-tronic transmission that drives the front wheels. It provides 114 horsepower, 85 kilowatts and 243 lbfd 330 newton meters of torque alone and results in a combined 201 horsepower 150 kilowatts and 258 lbfd 350 newton meters in the 40 tfsi e and a combined 268 horsepower 200 kilowatts and 295 lbfd 400 newton meters in the 45 tfsi e Audi says the entry-level plug-in hybrid A3 Sportback can hit 100 km per hour, 62 miles per hour, in 7.4 seconds and continue through to 225 km per hour, 140 miles per hour. While the flagship version reaches 100 km per hour in 6.3 seconds and won't stop accelerating until it hits 237 km per hour, 147 miles per hour. Providing the electric motor with its juice is a 25.7 kWh battery pack with 96 prismatic cells divided into four modules which store almost 50% more energy than before. This means both versions can travel up to 143 km, 89 miles, on electric power alone. As with other plug-in hybrid models, plenty of different driving and powertrain modes are available. The car always starts up purely in electric mode, and the paddle shifters can be used to adjust the level of brake regeneration. Both models also have a power boost function operated when the DCT is in S mode and the powertrain is in auto hybrid. This function gives the 40 TFSI E an extra 54 horsepower, 40 kilowatts, for up to 18 seconds and the 45 TFSI E an extra 94 horsepower, 70 kilowatts, for up to 8 seconds. The new Audi A3 Sportback TFSI E models are also important for the German mark as they are its first plug-in hybrids that offer DC fast charging at up to 50 kW, allowing the battery pack to be charged from 10% to 80% in less than 30 minutes.